the class of light. So today I'm going to explain to you about the importance of oxygen in the burning of a combustible substance. You must be wondering what is a combustible substance. So a combustible substance is any substance that catches fire very easily. Here I have a candle that can be considered as a combustible substance, a log of wood, a piece of paper, all these are examples of combustible substance. So let's go and do the experiment. For this experiment you will need candles, one will work if you have a lighter or a matchstick, a glass and these actions to be done under supervision of an elder. So, to, uh, so let's start with burning this candle. So I'm going to light up this and with the help of this, this Baidu candle. So yeah, you can see these flames, right? So I have two candles. What I'm going to do with one of the candles is put the glass over this small candle. See the magic. You see, this, this candle has a bit of air around it so it is glowing and now it stopped glowing but this candle is still burning but why is that happening you see this glass this is acting as a barrier for the oxygen this candle cannot get proper oxygen but this one is getting all the oxygen in the air as a conclusion we can say that air is important for anything to burn like we need oxygen to live and these candles also need oxygen not to live but to stay burning. So here you can see this is acting as a barrier but this doesn't have any barrier. So it is still glowing but this one stopped glowing. So thank you for watching.